Oh, so this is your family? Yes. Okay, and yeah. this is your grandma? Yeah, this is my grandma. Okay. Like other forms of folk photography, family albums are objects that are simultaneously connected with personal, emotional, social, and cultural exchanges. Today, let us expose the largest family image achieved in Hong Kong, Sim Lab Haoli, and see how this lab expresses themselves in Hong Kong. The reason why we created the archive is to celebrate local families, but also to give this free uh, royalty resource for local families. We hope that uh, people can find their own place within the larger history of Hong Kong through the images of our archive. In fact, this lab also is the only place in Hong Kong where there are few movies to watch, which is one of their iconic features. Thai Lane is an invisible museum that we have created to address the issue of gentrification frontally. This is a public art uh, performance. It's already been going on for seven, eight years, and it entails the reappropriation of these very expensive square feet in order to give back to the local community a free museum that is open 24 seven. And uh, actually, it's currently the only museum in Hong Kong that is open 24-7 and completely free. This is a brand new, completely different world from the surrounding stress. In a short period of time, people are isolated from the city and get an immersive experience. Sim Lab is very special. It was only welcome that I realized that the family image are objects that have deep emotional value but also have the personal meaning. There are also many ritual art in this place to enrich my spiritual world, which is like finding a secret base to release my soul. At Sim Lab, old family photos tell story of Hong Kong culture and heritage. At the same time, they can be interpreted as a way of understanding and recalling with life, happy and sad moments and the life development. My art practice understands both the museum and the archive as performances. So this route is questioning the legitimacy of who is able to uh, write history and ultimately who is able to shape the cultural heritage and the history writing. <laughs>